today's video, I was sent a giant collection box for free. Time to do, 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 do. What's up guys, we're back with another epic collection video and this time I didn't buy it. Cameron actually sent me a collection just because he's a fan of the collection videos. Before we actually get into that, we do have a giveaway. I'll be giving away this Heavy Storm BCCG 10. I actually gave this away in another video, then the guy won it and I lost it, I couldn't find it, so I sent him something else because I couldn't find this and then I was cleaning up recently and I found this. So I found it again like a year later after I lost it, so it's up for giveaway again. All you have to do, like the video, be subscribed, turn on notifications, let Cameron know that he is awesome for sending us this collection for free and for an awesome video. I mean, I don't even know what to say. I don't even know what it is, but it's pretty amazing because, you know, collection didn't even buy it. He was like, no, I don't want you to have to buy it. You just take it. So let's open it up and see what he gave us. All right, this thing's really large, so I'm going to open up over here. I really, uh, he sent me a couple things that were in here, but I tried not to look at them recently, so I don't remember. I know there are a couple of nice cards, though. It's not cutting open very well. I hate when you cut and you cut like into the side of the thing and you can't get it to go under it and just slice nicely. That's what's happening right now. All right, I got it. That took a little bit more work than I was expecting, but I got it. All right, first we have it in this bag, which makes it look like it's like, uh, you know, stinky or something, you know? <laughs> I don't know why this bag just makes me think of like, you got like your phone wet or something, you just threw it in there. This deck box has seen better days, that's for sure. We'll start with this one. Uh, we got some sort of dragon logo. I don't know this logo off the top of my head. Maybe it's nothing, but I'm pretty sure it's probably something. He said he had a couple of decks from back when he played. I think it was 2013, 2014 era. So let's see. Okay. Okay, I think he mentioned these two. He said, and no, I don't know who signed these. So if you guys know who signed these, maybe we could figure it out with the power of the internet. You know, somebody recognizes this from back in the day. We don't really know who it was. He prefaced it with like parentheses and no, I don't know who signed that card. So I don't know who that is. Crystal Wing Synchro. Wait, okay. 2013, 2014. Got to get into 2016 at least because the Crystal Wing Synchro came out in 2016. So I think he said 13 to 14, didn't he? Okay, not true. He actually said he placed top 64 at Nats in 2013-2014. So he might have played a little bit after that, but he had a pretty successful, you know, Nats. I mean, top 64 is pretty amazing. So Cameron was a stud back then. Okay, we have Abyss Dweller. Cyber, so what? That's crazy. I mean, sometimes they'll get these random old fusions. Uh, that's random that that's in there, but I assume that there was a use for it in this deck. You guys can let me know as I'm not the, you know, most uh, experienced duelist, let's say that. We have a Beredo, we have a Beret, we have another Beredo. So Kara Curry's obviously, we have the number 38. Star Eater Ultimate Rare, first ed, that's nice. Number 11, Big Eye, okay, this is a pretty cool deck. Whenever I receive like full decks, I usually like to keep them as full decks. I don't really like opening them, especially since he sent us this and like we're not having to buy it or anything like that. Usually then I'm like, okay, I gotta you know sell it or whatever. Here, I'm probably just gonna keep this in a, a memory of, of Cameron in his epic success with it, I guess. Okay, maybe not. This was not 2013, 14 when he placed top 64, but I'm guessing this is a pretty good deck as well. Dracosack was crazy. When did that Dracosack come out? Like 2013, I think, was the original print. Naturia Beast is really crazy. We have Nirvana High Paladin. I don't know if I've ever seen this card. I've heard the name. I don't know if I, by seeing, I mean like had it personally. Interesting. It's from uh, the Dark Illusion. Yeah, I didn't have not opened a lot of that set. So that's interesting. We have Red Eyes Flare Metal Dragon, gold version. Then another beret. So interesting how the extra deck is like, it might be sorted by rarity. Okay, not quite because those are at the front because it's weird because like the berets and the beretos are not together and <laughs> they're, they're just all over the place. So that's interesting. That's the extra deck. We got Desynchro, Raigeki, Gold Rare. Look, these old gold rares, I like them. They're pretty cool. Desynchros as well. Car Curry Strategist. Maybe I'll just keep this together and try to learn how to play it. I don't know. I don't know what, if this is a format people are actually playing though. It, what year is this? 2016? Something like that. Car Curry, maybe a little bit after that. A hypo. We have Solar Wind Jammer. We've got Cyber Dragon Dual Terminal. That's pretty cool. DT01. DT01. Maxi. Whoa. Maxi? Wait, I thought this has been banned for forever. When was this not banned? Upstart got. I'm just confused now. Is that a signature as well? I'm confused. I don't know what that is. Soul Charge. Iron Call. Have I ever seen this card? Hidden Arsenal. Probably didn't pay attention to it if it's Hidden Arsenal. Iron Call. What does it do? Tar control Machine Monster. Target one level four. Lower Machine Type Monster. Graveyard Special Summon. That target. Vex and Decay. Destroy it to the end of the battle phase. Okay, so that's good for bringing them back and Synchroing or Exceeding with a Machine Type. That makes sense. Instant Fusion. I'm guessing that's what the Cyber Source is for. Uh, another Instant Fusion. Look at the Astral Pack 6. Okay, I don't know if I've ever seen an Instant Fusion from Astral Pack 6. Dual Genesis, e -tellies. Rares, we got another ulti. A lot of a lot of ultis on the Curry Curry stuff. That's pretty nice. 
anti-spell, all different rarities. We've got dual terminal. That one looks more like the new dual terminal, or the hidden arsenal version. Uh, anti-spell fragrance, that's the common from Turbo Pack 2. Super from OTS 1, they're just all over the place. Maj Majesty's Fiend, a foreign dark hole, first edition. Is that say C? What is that, French Canadian or something? I don't know what C is. LDD I thought was Spanish or Portuguese, but I don't know what C stands for. Let me know in the comments, that's interesting. I don't know if I've ever seen one of those. Solemn Scolding, Mistake, I have pulled one of those before couple of mistakes and an unwavering bond okay that's pretty cool to go back into a an unknown era for me but i mean i don't remember which era it is i'm guessing it has to be at least 2016 so i would guess 2016 2017 in there but i feel like i don't even remember Kara curry ever being mentioned as being good so i'm not really sure because i came back in 2019 really to like have any sort of familiarity with the tcg and really it was really the 2020 2021 before i knew what the meta was not that i really know what the meta was but i kind of do okay next deck this might be the nats one this is the same kind of deck box i had a blue version of this ultra pro i love these deck boxes back in the day but they do not age well they get super sticky and like get stuff all over them which obviously happened here uh, i got rid of my old one but kept my deck out of it obviously but yeah these do not age well they're cool when you first get them then they get too sticky and gross and like attract all this stuff so is there no extra deck? Interesting, no extra deck in this deck. So this is the PK deck he was talking about. I guess this was the 2013 one. I didn't realize Phantom Knights were that old. Are they that old? Flying C, wait, what What? what set is this? Weira? I can't think of it, I don't know. And it's a common, so it's not like a side set. That's gotta be a main set, right? Well, maybe, okay, Gandarla. Oh, here's the extra deck, it's just, maybe this is a side deck, I don't know. Mecha Beast, we have the, okay, Phantom Knights, or not Phantom Knights, sorry, uh, Burning Abyss. Burning Abyss was, gold series and secrets of eternity right secrets of eternity i thought was 2015 so maybe he was just off on his years potentially number 47 we have number 30 phantom Knights of silent boots weira what is weira oh what is it oh i should know this i'm so disappointed okay yeah there's the uh the gold series versions of the burning abyss i just can't i can't keep reading those interrupted kaiju slumber got the kaijus out there thunder king the lightning ki strike kaiju a lot of kaijus in this deck farfa there you go farfa a couple of those we have ragged gloves we have skarm we have i don't even know how to say that guy's name skarm again and uh man is this really a how many cards is this okay i just double checked what he said this is a deconstructed deck so this is probably just like a lot of the he pulled out a lot of the staples and stuff and then the other one he said he tested with that car curry deck and you know it didn't really do anything so that makes more sense i was like this is not a 40 card deck here that makes sense deconstructed deck all right he also sent two binders which he said they told me the order to go in so i'm guessing they're going to be getting more and more exciting which are already pretty cool so far i didn't set up the binder viewing thing so we're just going to do it old school okay we have all right nothing too crazy there i'm guessing that there'll be some nice stuff throughout here okay secret rares mystical space typhoon probably just some staples in here the, the yusenjus those were big in duel links for a little bit uh kage to kage is a great card we have the uh kaijus more of those a token i don't know what that is arg circuit series that's what that is okay king of boyo these were like for a while for a hot minute they were like five ten bucks they might still be around there we are a little bit less than that but goyo defender zen mains what is this just a regular old timeout all right that's just a sleeve no test print or anything like that we have a monster reborn mass change number two is that a starter deck yugi monster reborn that's pretty cool we have um tyrant red dragon arch fiend there's more phantom knight swords so some of his phantom knight stuff's in here the goes and matches the wiretaps the full house more mst but not in the same spot that's interesting call the haunted another uh, sleeve probably in there we have more of the stuff from the gold series there we got a little star wars action right there sorry for the glare i'm doing my best we've got some uh, more gold series cosmo stuff got cosmo solar trooper we have a cosmo delta shuffle so a lot of cosmos around this area okay old school stuff we've got the uh, dark witch cyber jar puppet plants like 5ds era i think skull servant beaver warrior look at those five beaver warriors sangan for a magical library, it's kind of funny that Beaver Warrior's in here. Card Ejector. Valkyrian, that's a pretty cool old school card. Magical Scientist. Pot of Desires, that's a pretty new one. You know, 2017, I think it was released. No, no, no. This was released in Dark Illusion, so that might be 2016, actually. Pot of Extrav, when was that? Oh, that's Rarity. I think you might have opened some Rarity Collection, it looked like. So we got a little Rarity Collection. Fun, that's nice. Speaking of, a lot more Rarity Collection stuff in here. Very cool. Very, very cool more rarity collection so we have seen a lot of these cards recently well all of them we have a video if you guys have not seen my entire rarity collection binder go check it out 
Okay, more of that. So, you know, we've seen this stuff. It's all it's all good stuff, but we've seen it. Very, very cool. Don't want to spend too much time on it because we do have another binder coming up. I don't want you guys to get bored. You know, you've seen a lot of rarity collection. I mean, I know most people are not really tired of rarity collection yet. It's just so good. I'm just going to gloss over some of the stuff. Okay, Master Pendulum's a little bit different. Okay, the this is the core token. If you get the docs version of this, apparently it's really expensive. They're like 15 bucks, something like that. Because uh, there was only a European print. We've opened that before. Metaphol stuff. So some Metaphols cards. This is definitely a player's binder, you know. It's got some there's playable stuff, some staples, stuff like that. Cyber Dragon Infinity from Bosch. That's a secret. That's really cool. Cyber Dragon Infinity First Dead. That's really, really awesome. Thousand Eyes Restrict from Pharaoh Servant. Beautiful. Monster Gate. Allure. I don't know why those are upside down. You'll have to let me know in the comments. You guys might know. A little bit of extra deck. Black Rose. Solemn Strikes are in here. That's pretty nice. Secret Rares. Those are definitely not, like decent. Bosch, I think, is the original print, too. Cyframe Gear Alpha. Cyframe Gear Driver. Delta. Circuit. Where's the Gammas at? Okay, interesting. Maybe we saw those earlier. Infernoid Decatron. Infernoid. Anunk. Anunku? I don't know. And then another strike. So he's got a play set of strikes in here. That's really, really nice. All right, final binder. Cameron, very awesome. Super excited to see what's inside. Let's get to it. Here we go. This one feels like there's more cards in here. Sephira, another Cyber Dragon Infinity. That's pretty cool. That's an Unlim. The Naturia. That looks like a, a Grottle from Pokemon. Oh, we got a couple of Ghost Rares. They're Haunted Mine, but still, Gores is really cool. And Ultimate Tour Guide. What in the world? Holy, that's an English copy, too. Time out. We got to look at this. And by the way, I don't know if you see that too. Solemn warning. Oh my goodness. Whoa. Wasn't expecting this in here. He may have actually told me this and I missed it, but I'm assuming he didn't tell everything for the, because he likes the collections and we usually like to go through blind. So he probably didn't tell me all the good stuff. I don't think I've ever owned this card. This will be going into the personal collection because Cameron is insane, dude. That's actually in really good condition too. I know people hate when I do that. I take them out of the old sleeve, put them in a penny sleeve. But when it's been sitting in the same sleeve for a long time, it's a little icky, you know, for me, just cause I'm like super weird about sleeves. And I put them in penny sleeves so I don't like ding any corners or anything like that. That is insane. Oh my goodness. I'll be checking that out again later. Also a BPT Dark Magician, which isn't even in a sleeve. That's such a sweet card. Not great condition, but a sweet card. All right, Solemn Warning. We have an ultimate rare that is incredible. From d -Rep. It's an Unlim, but who cares? Like, that is, is... I think we invested in one of these, didn't we? No, we invested in... No, maybe it was a warning. Can't remember. That is a really cool card. These cards are in good condition, too. It's like... They look really good. All right, and speaking of foreign tour guides, there's one right there. There's Gores right there. That's amazing. There's, uh... Let's see. First Ed Legendary Collection. Yugi's World is nice. I mean, all this stuff is really cool. A, a Dimensional Fisher. This was 20 bucks. I didn't got a reprint recently. Still really nice. What a cool collection, man. This is Horn of Heaven, Time Space Trap Hole, Bujinki Amaterasu. Oh, do I need that in first ed? Secret? Maybe? Probably on limbs that I actually need, but may I might need that. Cardinal. Baxia Secret? Oh, it's not the Duelist Alliance, but still good. I thought it was Duelist Alliance, because that'd be the original print. That also comes in ulti, I think. Uh, Vinny's Emptiness, that's beautiful. 5D is actually a pretty nice print of it. Alien Warrior Ultis, that's pretty cool. More ultis, Utopia Roots. We've got the uh, Noble Knights guy, whatever his name is. Artorius? I don't know. <laughs> Runa's Pendulum. Oh, this guy. We always pull this guy out of Lord of Tachyon Galaxy. Still really cool. Ultimate rare as well. And Twister out of Stun. Man, this is definitely... I see why he wanted this one to be last. Uh, Prohibition's very nice. Really, really cool binder. Just a great binder. Oh, what is this? Oh, the JMP version. That's sweet. Another jump, but like the second version, I think? I can't remember the order of those. It's a lot of cards here. I think there's like multiples of some of these in there. Spectral Sword. I like I like the Shiranui. It's the cool stuff. Skill Drain. We used to be big. Got a lot of reprints. Still cool. What what version is this? That looks like a German. The DE, I think, is German. For all our German fans out there, we have uh, Gamma Seal. We have Miracle Fusion. Very nice. Really nice stuff here. I mean, this is a sweet binder. Abyss Sphere. I remember we bought a collection a long time ago, like a $4,000 collection. We made a video. Had a bunch of these Abyss Spheres in it, Abyss stuff. That was a really fun collection uh, that I remember fondly. Okay, we have Fog Knight, or Fog Blade, I should say. The Tarantula, the reprint of the uh, prize card. I remember this from Duel Links. Yeah, I'm playing Duel Links again. I know, I know. We have Effect Failure. There's a lot of cards in here, too. This is not like a... This binder is not empty. More... Okay, we're back to more of the, uh, the gold stuff that he had in the other binder. So this is probably more... He probably opened a lot of this gold, it seems like. Or at least he bought a lot of singles from it. Either way. 
More soup. Man, this is sweet. There's more mer mermails. Mermails. That's what I was trying to think of earlier that I got a lot of out of that one collection. Okay, rivalry. Very cool. Forbidden chalice. Soul lockbirds. Those are hollows. That's pretty good. We have pot of awesome. The legend is awesome. Okay, very cool. Hey, Raid Raptor. We're almost to the end here. Um, oh, man. More ultis. A lot more ultis. First of all, we got uh, Sheba Warrior, very awesome. Another ulti here. These are all ultis. Lots of ultimate rares. We got uh, another tw another Twister. That must have been a good card. Lightning Chidori, Naruto. A uh, Divine Wrath. That's pretty cool. Oh, wow. A Phoenix Wing Windblast. It looks like it's not in great condition, but that's still a good card. And a First Hit Ancient Berry Dragon. Ultimate rare. Wow. Okay. And then, of course... Deck Devastation Virus, or Crush Card Virus, different card, Crush Card Virus. I get them confused, but Crush Card, this is the Kaiba one. Actually, they both are Kaiba, aren't they? This is the Legend, Duelist Pack Kaiba, that's what I'm trying to say. Okay, I figured it out. So huge shout out to Cameron. That is a really awesome collection that he sent us. I mean, I don't even remember. I think someone sent us a free collection like three or four years ago. This is the last time this happened. It doesn't happen often because, I mean, most people aren't just going to do that. So it's really, really kind of him and I appreciate him supporting me by doing that. I'm definitely gonna keep some of those big cards in my collection, so shout out to Cameron. I really appreciate you supporting the channel with the video and the, the collection as well. I'm glad you enjoy the other collection videos and hopefully other people will enjoy yours today. And if you guys enjoyed the video, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Shout out to Tonefo Show, Daxter, Puffins of Doom, Ernesto Deanna, America Deutster, Leo Gwine 62, Brad KK Beats, Ananda Tai Show, Ian Musa, Junior Barding, Robert F, Thomas McLean, Changalang, and Joey Castle. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.